Hey guys and welcome back to TechForce. So today we'll be taking a look at a pretty good budget smartwatch called the Cubot C3. Now this watch only comes for $50 and it's got quite a few nice features built into it such as waterproofing, sleep tracking and heart rate monitoring. So let's take a look and see whether this smartwatch is actually worth buying. Now let's begin with what comes inside the box. So first of all, the box itself is quite nice and does have a professional look and feel to it. And inside the box we have the smartwatch itself, a magnetic charging cable, a spare strap and then of course the manuals. So overall, I think it certainly comes with everything you need and a nice bonus is that spare strap. However, both of the straps you get are exactly the same, which isn't a huge problem but I would feel I do feel that it's nice to have two different straps, and this obviously isn't an issue though. But it would be great uh, if that we did if we did have two different straps. But then again, we do get a spare strap, which is something that doesn't really come with smartwatches these days. So in terms of the design of the smartwatch, it's surprisingly very nice. Considering it only costs fifty dollars, you wouldn't expect it to have such a refined finish. So the watch body is made from metal, and it has got some weight to it but it's not too heavy in the hand obviously. So in the hand it does feel like a more premium watch which is great. Then the strap is also quite nice. It comes with a pretty standard silicone strap and then you have two colour choices which are black or grey. Now unfortunately these are the only two straps they have available but the strap is a standard 22mm one which means that you're able to use another strap that you may have lying around or other straps that they sell online uh, for other brands as well, as long as there's the same 22mm ones. Now although the build quality is very nice, I do feel as though the weakness to this watch, and well most budget watches in general, is the software. This is often because budget watches use general smartwatch apps which haven't been designed specifically for that watch. So the smartwatch doesn't come with the greatest software and customizability options. In terms of the software, the smartwatch has a few main features, and these include being able to display notifications that you receive to your phone, uh, track the number of steps you've walked, track your heart rate, track your sleep, and also a few other things. But then again, for $50, these are all of the basic features you would expect to find. And in general, navigation around the watch is also very straightforward. You simply swipe in different directions and are able to access certain features. Then you can push the button with the grey accent on it to be taken to a main menu where you can scroll through a, a few different options to choose something you wish to do. So overall, this smartwatch certainly has some great features built into it, and considering it's only $50, I would definitely think about buying it. Compared to other smartwatches on the market at this price point, it's certainly quite a bit better, as it has all the necessary features you'd want. And on top of these main features, you also have waterproofing, which means that it's safe to wear in the shower or even in the swimming pool. Therefore, I'd highly recommend you go to the description below and click on the link to find out more about this watch. And whilst you're there, don't forget to subscribe and leave a like. Thanks for watching and goodbye.